media houses and people who provide information need to be more transparent in our in our work so need to i mean it's becoming far more um, common not only in water around the world for there to be um, media houses where you don't know where the funding is coming from you don't know who's actually behind them you don't know what their biases are you don't know what what's the agenda they're pushing you don't know you don't know what they actually what they stand for ultimately and i think a lot of people are a little bit confused and we've seen this in Malta, we've seen this elsewhere so you can't really blame people for being for losing faith in the media when there are so many i don't want to call them bad actors because i mean some of them are not bad actors but there are so many voices forming part of the media environment where you don't really know how trustworthy or not they are you don't really know whether they're um they're uh, somehow a front for some political organization or for some lobby group or for some um, particular voice. So I think we in general need to be more transparent in terms of who we are, what we stand for, how we're financed, why we're focusing on certain issues and not others, why we say certain things the way we do. Even in terms of fact checkers, like I mean, we try to be as transparent as we can in terms of we try to make the, the fact checks we provide as verifiable as possible. So the idea is that the public can actually go and carry out the same fact check the same way we did, if possible. It's not always possible because sometimes pub, uh, information isn't in the public domain. Uh, but where possible, we try to kind of show the way we're working and the structure that we're we're following. So I think that is kind of the best answer we have at the moment in terms of being less reactive. So trying to regain the trust of the public by being more transparent about who we are, you know, what we're working for, what we stand for, where our money is coming from, you know, who our journalists are, who, who works for us, who we associate with, all these sort of things.